Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Mayank and I'm a second year student at HEC Paris specializing in marketing. In this video, I'm gonna take you on a short trip to the supermarket. I'm not gonna buy a full load of groceries, but just a few things to top up. Towards the end, I will share with you how much I spent in total in this trip, as well as how much I spend normally every month. Before we get started, I want to tell you to go follow me on Instagram. I've been posting stories, reels, and photos from my life in France and at HEC. And so you should go follow me. My handle is some uh, here, so you should just just go follow me there. All right, with that out of the way, let's get started. The campus has been really beautiful lately with the onset of spring and the temperatures going up pretty high. It's been about 24, 25 degrees in the hottest part of the day recently. And there are actually cherry blossoms growing as well, which is so nice. It's the best day to go to the supermarket. Actually, I'm kidding. Any day is a good day to go buy food. One of the cool things about HEC is that right outside the campus gate, there is a supermarket that we all know and love. It's called the Auchan. And whenever I go shopping there, I always make sure to take my own shopping bag made of cloth because I don't like plastic bags. First things first, I'm gonna get myself this frozen bag of chicken, potatoes, and onions, which is rated A on the Nutri score and is super easy to make. It takes like 10 minutes. I usually have this twice a week, sometimes more if I'm feeling lazy, adding some spices to make it even nicer. This costs 3 euro 77 cents. You know what's not rated A on the Nutri score? These Hagen dazs ice creams, which look amazing, but I chose not to buy at, at, at least today. But they're great. They cost between five to six euros for a pack of four little ones. I also have to buy a pack of chicken wings because that's something I'm really enjoying cooking and eating recently. These cost two euro 77 cents for enough chicken wings to make two servings. There's also now a new bakery at the Auchan and I get myself a French baguette to have as a snack later on. This cost me one euro. I also need some chicken slices that I could either have within a sandwich or just eat it with the baguette. These cost two euros for four slices. There's also an Asian section at the Auchan, which has a lot of East Asian food. There's not that much Indian food there, except for this kind of underwhelming jar of chicken tikka masala sauce, which I've had it, it's all right, it's not bad, but it's not like, it's not authentic. Interestingly, there's also a chicken tikka masala flavored can of Pringles, which is really nice. I get myself some Easter eggs because it's Easter very, very soon, and I just wanted to get them. I also get some real eggs so that I can have them for breakfast. The Easter eggs cost me two euro 95 for four of them, and the real eggs cost me one euro 22 cents for a pack of six. There's also this cheese that my friend recommended to me. It's basically Gouda cheese with some cumin in it. It cost me two euros. Before I leave, I also go through the fruit section and find this little sack of mandarins, which are basically tiny little mini oranges, which are super cute and very tasty. And I also get a broccoli to cook with the chicken that I bought earlier. The mandarins cost me one euro 49 for a sack of one kg and the broccoli was one euro 25. And that's it, it's time for checkout. After adding a little bag of fried onions and some Mexican spice, that I found near the checkout area and I got tempted. I spent a total of 23 euros 77 cents today. That's around 2000 Indian rupees. Okay, keep in mind that this is specifically for the Auchan supermarket. So in France, there's no concept of MRP like we have it in India. Some places are cheaper, others are more expensive. Lidl, for example, is another supermarket which is even cheaper than the Auchan. But the downside of that one is that it's usually in the outskirts of the city and you need a car to get there. And then we have other supermarkets like Monoprix and Franprix, which are like far easier to get to, but they're also a lot more expensive. Thankfully for me, there's an Auchan right outside HEC. So that's not a very expensive supermarket and it's also conveniently located, so it's great. And then it was time to go home and eat my baguette. So now that you saw how much I spent in this one trip, how much do I spend in a month? Normally for my diet and preferences, I end up spending around 200 euros a month at the supermarket. While most of that is on food, keep in mind that that also includes a bit of alcohol, since you also get alcohol at the supermarkets here. The Auchan, for example, has a pretty huge selection of beers, wines, and spirits. And alcohol here is actually way cheaper than back in India. Okay, so I hope this video gave you a good idea of what it's like to go to a supermarket in France, or at least the one at HEC, as well as how much it can cost generally. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. It really helps me out a lot. You can also hit the subscribe button because I'll be uploading a lot more content just like this, even though I haven't uploaded in the last one month because things have been getting pretty busy here. But I generally keep up a once a week video upload schedule. You can also check out the two videos that appear on the screen right now. I think they might help you out as well. See you guys in the next one.